I want to get your comment on 1 Corinthians 16. Be watchful, stand firm in the faith, act like men, or in the King James, quit you like a man, be strong. Yes. Let all that you do be done in love. Can you talk about that? I can, Chaff, but see here, I, I want to go back to uh, the fact that Matthew chapter 5, verse 13, you are the salt of the earth. I ask this question, uh, why salt? Uh, you would look at American Christianity and you'd think we're the sugar of the earth. We're the, we're the honeycomb, we're the cotton candy. That, that, that if, you, if you are a bold Christian man who calls them like you see them, people say, oh, that's hateful. Well, we have a saying that we like to throw around, and that saying is this. Truth sounds like hate to those who hate the truth. And I believe that we are in the mess that we are in but because for the most part, Christian men in particular have refused to stand up and engage in the cultural battle. We've hired Republicans. We've hired mercenaries to fight the fight that I believe God mandated the church to fight. So I believe, chaps, if we could bring back a manly gospel and a manly Christianity, I think men would once again return to church and take a much more active role. But as it is right now, man, going to church, thats a, I hate to say it, it's a pretty, pretty sissified thing, uh, at least the music and all that stuff. And I'm after men, and I want to train up godly men who will serve the Lord in the fear and the admonition of the Lord. I want to defend the Lord, not sit on his lap.